Good morning, I'm Belle, welcome back to my channel. Today is Saturday the 11th of January 2020 and today I'm going to show you what I eat in a day. So um, I do the Slimming World plan and um, it's Saturday so I'm off work today and I'm going to the supermarket and I haven't got any milk or yogurt or anything so breakfast this morning is a Kenko caramel black coffee because I haven't got any milk and then I've just got an orange which is a speed food and a persimmon which is a free food and this is how I am starting my Saturday. So it's about half past two I just met a friend for a drink at Costa and was a very good just had a diet coke um i'm now super hungry because i haven't had any lunch yet so um i just popped into iceland to get a few of the swimming world meals and i got some of these alpa night bars this is a salted caramel i think they're three sins you can have two as your healthy extra b um at the moment i will probably count it as half my healthy b but then i might change that later um so so far i've just eaten the orange the persimmon i've had a diet coke and then i'm gonna have this um i got a few meals in iceland and so I will show you those later on um but yeah I hope you're well it is a cold miserable day today but um yeah I will show you what I got when I get home so it's half three and I'm just back from shopping it is so dark outside for half three January is not my favorite month anyway I ended up having two of the Alpen light bars um, that I showed you earlier. So that will be my healthy B done for the day. So I'm gonna get something to eat in a second because as I said, I haven't had lunch and I'm really hungry, but I thought I'd quickly show you what I got in Iceland. There was so much great stuff. They had loads of freezers with Slimming World meals, but they also had loads of like, sort of Slimming World friendly bits and pieces like the Uncle Ben's rice. And um, they had a few bits that I've got that I'll show you in a sec, but just lots of bits and pieces. Also, if you're unaware, the um, Slimming World um, offer at the moment at Iceland is three Slimming World meats or meals and you get some Muller Lights free. So I'll show you those in a sec. Um, yeah, so I really had to stop myself getting loads of them because I haven't got any space in my freezer. Um, so yeah, I only got a few, but I will show you what I got. I'm gonna have to do this in two bits because I can't fit them all in my space. I'm filming on a new phone and I don't really know what I'm doing with it. So I hope this is all turning out okay. But anyway, I got the Slimming World free food. So if you don't know, everything from the Slimming World range at Iceland, I'm pretty sure is free. So, um, as in a free food. So I got the Slimming World Diet Coke Chicken. So I have made Diet Coke Chicken once before. I really liked it. So I'm hoping this is gonna be just as good. Um, so this is, obviously they're frozen, but this is what it looks like. So plenty of chicken. Um, and then I think peppers, sugar snap peas, um, all that kind of stuff in there. So that looks good. Then I got a Slimming World uh, Chicken Balti. So it says a feast of chicken, roasted red peppers and slow roasted onion petals. Does that say onion petals? Yeah. And slow roasted onion petals in a mildly spicy curry sauce. And it says it's only one spiciness. Um, I don't mind spicy food, but I know some people aren't keen. Um, so that looks good. Again, loads of chicken, um, onions, peppers, all that kind of stuff. Um, I got some more Slimming World chips. I absolutely love these, done in the act fry with um, fry light and um, some chip seasoning. So um, that is this, and I will um, grab the other bits that I got. So as I mentioned, when you get three meals or meats from the um, Slimming World range at Iceland, um, you get some yogurts free. So there weren't any on the shelf, but I spoke to the lady and she went and got some out. Um, any on the shelf. There weren't any in the fridge. They'd all gone. So she went out the back and got me some more. So um, flavours are cinnamon bun flavour and lemon drizzle cake. Um, I am possibly the world's biggest fan of cinnamon buns. They remind me of being in America and um, eating cinnamon swirls and I absolutely love the ones in Starbucks. A couple of seconds in the microwave, oh my goodness. But they are high on the sin count. So I'm hoping these yogurts, which will be, I would imagine half a sin each, are going to curb my cravings for cinnamon buns. So looking forward to trying them. Um, then, 
Um, they had skinny whips in uh, Iceland, which I've not seen in there before. So um, these are the strawberry flavour. I can't remember on the sins. I think it's four and a half or five sins. Um, but these are really nice. They also had the um, chocolate ones as well. Um, then I got some more Alpen lights. So I got the salty caramel ones that I showed you. And I've also got some Jaffa cake ones. Um, the Alpen light bars, as I mentioned earlier, are three sins each. Or you get two for your healthy B. Just make sure you get the Alpen lights because the normal Alpen bars are obviously higher on the sin count. And the packets look pretty similar. So it's easy to make a mistake. Um, I got some Uncle Ben's long grain rice because I think this was just a pound um, so when I see it for a pound I often pick it up um, then I got a couple more meals so I got the vegetable Dan sack I can't remember if I've had this before um, but it says a free mild curry packed with roasted vegetables red lentils and chickpeas picture looks very colorful uh, but this one is what it looks like so butternut squash chickpeas that kale or spinach or something and then tomatoes so um that will be nice with the uncle ben's rice and then lastly i got the slimming world free food soy ginger chicken noodles i don't think i've had this before i'm assuming this is one of the new ones um but that looks lovely um and that with um some rice and some veggies hopefully will be lovely um so yeah um, so this is what I got in Iceland. I am going to have something for lunch, not sure what yet, but I will show you once I have decided. So it is five to four and I didn't want to have like a proper massive meal because um, I want to have dinner tonight and if I have a big meal now I won't be hungry later. But also I didn't want to not have anything because then I'll just pick on rubbish. So earlier in the week, because I'm aware that one of the areas that I can fall down on is coming home late and not being bothered um, to cook or whatever, whatever, um, I pre-prepared a couple of things. So I got a big bag of chopped Mediterranean veg from Sainsbury's, I think, um, and just chucked it in the oven to roast with some fry light and some spices and bits and pieces um so all speed in there so butternut squash courgette onions peppers etc etc um and so i just roasted that for about half an hour or so 40 minutes um and then i've just kept it in the fridge for as and when um so i have just added um 35 grams of sainsbury's lighter grated mature british cheese which is going to be my first healthy extra a of the day um so i just added 35 grams of that now um if you're new to slimming world i would say one of my top tips is to make sure you've got some scales um because your um healthy a and healthy b do need measuring um when you guess the amount of cheese or the amount of cereal you're allowed sadly you're often very very far off so um, I've just weighed out 35 grams of the lighter cheese, um, given it a stir, and then I've heated it up in the microwave. So this smells absolutely lush. I love roasted veggies. Um, and as I say, this is all speed food. I might add a little bit of sriracha chili sauce to this. Um, I'll only add probably half a sin's worth. I've got a glass of water. I've got some seafood sticks or fish sticks or whatever you call them, which are a free food. And then I have got one of the cinnamon bun um, Miller lights I just showed you for half a sin. So it'll be half a sin for that, half a sin for the sriracha um, and everything else I think is sin free and um, just having it with a glass of water. So um, just one sin for today's late lunch, mid afternoon snack, whatever we're calling this. Um, but yeah, this is what I'm going to eat now. So it's just gone six o'clock and I'm just gonna get dinner ready. So I think I'm gonna have one of these, which is the Slimming World Chicken Ball Tea that I showed you earlier. So I'm just gonna do that in the microwave. I've got an Uncle Ben's uh, long grain rice, which is one sin that I do in the microwave. Um, and then I've got some veggies for my speed. So carrot, broccoli and cauliflower, um, which again, I will do in the microwave. So um, this will all be one sin, but I will show you what it all looks like on the plate. So it's just before seven o'clock and this is tonight's dinner. So I've got the veggies that I did in the microwave. I've got actually half of the rice because I decided I didn't eat the whole lot, um, which will therefore be half a sin. Um, and then I have got the Slimming World Chicken Ball Tea. Um, so sin-wise at the moment here is just half a sin for the rice. 
um, uh, but I'm going to add half a sin of Tesco's light garlic mayonnaise uh, just to have with my veggies um, and I've just got a glass of water. So tonight's dinner will be one sin. So it is nine o'clock and I just fancy something sweet. So I'm going to finish my day with a persimmon, which is a free food like I had for breakfast. I'm going to wash and slice that. And I've got one of the Muller Lights I showed you earlier, the lemon drizzle flavour for half a sin. So I think that will mean that I'm finishing my day on two and a half sins, which does sound quite low. But um, A, I've eaten loads, but also... Um, I had a bit of an incident with a Terry's chocolate orange yesterday, so um, I think it's quite fine to have today as a lower sin day. So, in terms of what I've eaten today, really enjoyed my fruit for breakfast. Feel proud of myself for to um, for going to Costa and just having a diet coke because coffee shops are definitely one of my danger zones. So that was good. Really, really like those roast veggies, and I think cooking them ahead of time and having them sort of in the fridge when I got in today meant that I didn't just have like a packet of crisps or something like that because um yeah it was there ready and all I had to do with heat was heat it up so that was absolutely delicious really enjoyed that um and my curry this evening was nice but I've said before my taste personally is for curries to be a little like for um curries to be a little bit sweeter um but for a free you know a, f a free sin free meal it was it was nice and uh, definitely very filling um, my favourite lowest in curries are the lamb, I think it's the lamb Rogan Josh from Aldi is lower is low-ish on the sins. It's not free. Um and also there is a um there are a couple of MS curries which are lower on the sins, one in a can and one that is like a fresh curry which are lower on sins, and I really, really enjoy those. So um the one I had today from Iceland was very nice, but I think I prefer the others, even if they have got a few sins in them. I think they are slightly more to my taste. But yeah, it's been a good down plan. Oh, and I really enjoyed that cinnamon uh, yogurt earlier. Definitely doesn't, you know, it's not like having a cinnamon swirl, but you know, it was good. So I'm hoping the lemon one will be nice too. And these persimmons are so, so lovely. I really, really enjoy these. So anywho, um, a, another good day on plan. Um, I'm sorry if this looks a bit odd. As I said earlier, I'm using a new phone and I don't really know how to work it or how to use the camera. So uh, I mean, this could well be all over the place, but normal filming will resume soon. Uh, but anyway, thank you so much for watching as always. I hope you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, please do give it a thumbs up. And as always, do check the Synapple calculator for anything that I've mentioned today. But I hope you're all well and I'll see you all soon in my next video. Take care. Bye.